Really? An AI made this ebook? If you'd like to learn a little bit more about that, stick around to the end. Hey, I'm Henry and I'm from Product Creation Formula. And here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks to better help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that sounds interesting to you, have you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. All right, guys, let's go check it out. Now, here we are at ChatGPT, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be prompting it to do everything from niche research right through to the actual content creation of itself. Now, it is helpful if you know a little bit about the topic you're going to be writing about. So when you find the sub niches that you're going to be looking for, make sure it's something you might know a little bit about or you've done some study into and know a little bit about it because occasionally ChatGPT does get it wrong and it's always good to know if they've made a mistake or not. And this way you can actually get in there and correct it if necessary. So let's have a look at the prompts, which I'm gonna be leaving in the description box down below if you wanna use them. And you're more than welcome to use the prompts that I am about to show you. I have three main prompts right here that I'm going to be using. You got niche research prompts, you got book outline prompts, and writing prompts. So this one here will vary and change depending on what it's doing. Sometimes if you want to add more information, you can say continue or give more information about this particular point. Or if you find a, a particular paragraph that you want to expand on, you can say please expand on this. But the three main ones we're going to be using are these three here. Please write me 10 of the most profitable niches to make money online. Write three niches for each main niche. Also go three levels deep for each sub niche. Be specific. So what we're doing is we're really drilling down to be able to find the best sub niches for a particular main topic. And we're going really deep. So let's have a look here, and I'm just gonna copy this and paste that straight into ChatGPT. Now, while it's happening, I'll also pause the video until it's finished writing, because it does have 10 levels. It does have 10 niches it's gonna be writing. So I'm gonna pause the video until then. Okay, so right now it just stopped, and we'll just hit continue, and let it finish doing this thing. Okay, so now we can go down and have a look at all of the niches here. And as you can see, it did finish up Halfway along, so let's go have a look at what they've got here. You got health and wellness, weight loss, keto diet and weight loss. Okay, that's a very good sub niche to get into. Intermittent fasting is another very good one. And then you got high intensity in interval. Now, if it's very helpful if you know anything about any of these particular topics. Now, I know a little bit about this because I did a keto diet a while back, lost a lot of weight, but ended up putting it back on due to other reasons. Anyhow, not going into that. Go through and you can have a look at the various points they have here. You got budgets, okay. Side hustles, okay, that's good. They call it side hustles. You can also be make money online, you got online surveys, affiliate marketing, freelance writing. So, look, I know a bit about affiliate marketing, so I'm just going to copy that one. So, I'm going to be working with that particular one there. If I have a look, I wanted if I really, really wanted to, I could do something on keto as well because I know a bit about that as I lived it for over a year and. Yeah, you can go through and have a look at what they have here. Now, I did have it continue on and have a look at the various type of things you got here. And you might have an interest in another one of these, but that's okay. So what we are now going to do is we're going to go over here and we're going to now go to the second prompt. Now, this one here is about the book outline. Now, please write an ebook outline for the topic, in this particular case, affiliate marketing. Make it 10 chapters long. Please do it in sequential order and make it a step-by-step -step process. I'm just going to copy that, place that straight into here. In fact, I might even make it 12 chapters long. And we'll go copy over the top of that, and we'll say affiliate marketing, and then all we need to do is hit enter and let it do its thing. Now, we're going to pause the video until it's finished writing. Okay, so it does look like it is actually finished. And what it has here, what is affiliate marketing? So that's really the first one that's going to be doing it. So you've got chapter one, Introduction to affiliate marketing. What is affiliate marketing? Why is affiliate marketing popular? A way to, to make money online. How does affiliate marketing work? Okay, so this now brings us to the next point. Now let's go find the other prompt, the last prompt. So we're gonna go over here. We go here. In reference to the ebook mentioned above, please write in detail about chapter, in this particular case, one. The point about 
what is affiliate marketing. I might even copy that and paste that straight in there. Or I might even just copy this entire thing and put that into ChatGPT and fill that blank in here. What is affiliate marketing? Just copy that, including the question mark, straight into this section just here. And then all we need to do is hit enter. And we'll see what it writes and comes up with. Affiliate marketing is a popular and lucrative way to make money online by promoting other people's products or services. You might be happy with just that little tiny bit to explain it, or you may wish to expand it. If you wanted to make, if you wanted to give you more information, you can do that. Now, one of the things I would highly suggest is when you grab hold of this, put it straight into a text document, not straight into the Word document. Let me show you why you don't want to put this straight into a Word document. I'm going to go over here to a Word document, and if I was to place that straight into a Word document, that is precisely what I will get. So if you wish to not have that, we'll just hit undo. All we need to do is place that into a blank text document, and we can use that blank text document and place it straight into there. And then all we need to do is just go Control A, Control C to copy it, and then we can place this straight into here without any issues whatsoever. So you can also do that right through the entire thing. Now, if you find there's a paragraph that you don't particularly like, or you'd like to expand a little bit more on it, you might decide that, okay, the process of affiliate marketing is simple. First to choose a niche or a topic that you're interested in and that you're hungry and you have a hungry market then, and you read through and say, okay, copy that. Please expand on this point. And then you can just make sure you, I always put quotation marks there control and then just finish quotation marks and then go there and let it continue there you can literally play put that straight underneath this section just here or wherever it was i got it from and then once you've done that that now fills out that section and makes it a bit bigger and gives people way more information if you wish to so essentially that is how you can create this now if you wish to you can also go to somewhere like Quillbot to get it to rewrite it completely so as it becomes a completely different thing to what ChatGPT is. For some reason, people are noticing that you know ChatGPT has written something in a particular way. So if you wish to, you can actually get take it to Quillbot and get Quillbot to rewrite it for you if you wish to. Once you it's a it's an extra step in the process if you want to do that. And a lot of people highly recommend it. And I can see why, because if you're going to be putting it on somewhere like Amazon or anywhere like that, they're going to end up having chatbots or some sort of bot that's going to be able to pick up on things like content that's written by ChatGPT because it's going to recognize how it writes things and it's going to take it and say, okay, this is written by a bot. Let's now block this one or close that person's account. So in this particular case, to avoid your account getting closed down, go to somewhere like Quillbot and get it to rewrite the content for you. And you use, you'll usually find that the content written by Quillbot or rewritten by Quillbot is really good anyway. And it was not going to harm any chance of having that published on anywhere like, say, for example, Amazon. Okay, but make sure, as I said, read through everything. Make sure it hasn't made any mistakes. And if it has made any mistakes, correct it yourself because you don't want to be putting out a product that has major mistakes all the way through it. Well, it's a, pretty much, it is as simple as that. All right, guys. Now, if you got some value out of this video, have it you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. Hey, while you're at it, why not consider sharing and also leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this video. Also, let you know that right here is a video I believe you might like. Down here is a video YouTube thinks you might like. And right here, is an image of my head. Now, if you click on that, you'll be able to subscribe. Thank you so, so much for watching and bye for now.